the forehead of your robot. The early 2000s brought with it a new generation of console gaming, the PlayStation 2. It was with this console that many classic games were born, from Grand Theft Auto to Final Fantasy. However among these titles there was one, an RPG game, that seemed to have vanished without a trace. The game was rumored to be developed by a small studio known as Grendel Games, and players who got their hands on a copy would often tell of its intense, almost grotesque graphics. It was said that the monsters were far more realistic than the genre had ever seen before, and often appeared so real, so lifelike, that some players refused to go any further. The name of the game was rumored to be, Fallen, which was, again, rumored to be released back in 2002, specifically October 20th of the same year, how fitting. It was also said that during the 2000s E3, someone found an old rusted built warehouse containing Fallen as its booth. That detail seems to confuse people even more about its release and the game itself. The most disturbing thing about the game was its plot. It told the story of a small town that was overrun by a powerful group of monsters and the players had to try and save the citizens from the creature's clutches, something made all the more difficult due to the intense gore. Players were said to be appalled at the lengths the game went to in order to depict the carnage and were even further disturbed by the lack of a clear solution to the problems presented throughout the game. Unfortunately, despite its great potential, the game never saw a release. It was speculated that Grendel Games ran into trouble with the ratings board and the game was pulled from the shelves before it ever hit them. As the years passed, its memory eventually faded and it was all but forgotten, until now. It was rumored that not only eBay listings were shown during 2002 to 2006 but there were leaked screenshots. However, the screenshots were later defunct as Nightmare Creatures screenshots, mostly the PC version and the eBay listings and the sellers themselves were later banned. Grendel Games tried to make a resurrection and made a web browser MMORPG game called Fallen Returns, released with another company named Black Residue Games, and released in 2007, that was unfortunately lost in time and then later deleted. Then, if things couldn't get even confusing and just one last dosage of confusion, during 2003's E3 later that year, it was said someone secretly questioned someone from PlayStation on what happened to Grendel Games and if Fallen was to return. The person was a worker named Chaz Pennington, who worked on the hardware on the PlayStation and the PlayStation 2. Chaz reportedly said that Fallen was to never return because when it was released, PlayStation accordingly lost almost $200 million in just over a week alone. It may not sound like much, but back then, PlayStation were at the end of their rope when it came to releasing games, even acquiring movie licensing companies like Disney, Paramount Pictures, DreamWorks, and Nickelodeon, didn't help pick themselves back up, until franchises like Jack and Daxter, Ratchet and Clank, and Sly Cooper, eventually helped them up. To this day, only the promotional box art from E3 was the only thing that surfaced, the rest are unfortunately lost in time.